All right, hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to uh, another Daily Devo with the Bishop on February 9th. Um, Brittany is not pregnant, by the way. Um, back in 2015, of January of 2015, I was in Amarillo. Yeah, Brittany's going to kill me for the title of this message. I already know it. This is this is a terrible idea. I shouldn't have gone live. I should have pre-recorded this and uploaded it and thought about what I was going to do. Um Either way, uh, January 2015, I was driving down the road. I was in Amarillo uh, working out there, and I got a text message on my phone, and I looked down at my phone, and it was a picture. So I clicked on the picture, and the picture was of a pregnancy test. And when I looked at the pregnancy test, it was positive. Now, you might be like, why did you get a picture of a pregnancy test? It was from Brittany, um, and Brittany was pregnant. And you're probably thinking, why did she text you? Why didn't she tell you? Why didn't she call you? I had specifically asked her, uh, a, a long time before that, I had asked her to, on our first child, to not tell me in person and to not tell me over the phone because I did not know how I was going to react. I didn't know if I was going to freak out. I didn't know if I was like going to run away. I didn't, I didn't know what I was going to do. Um, so I said, hey, when you find out you're pregnant, um, I need for you to text me a picture of it. That way I know because I, like, I just I didn't know how I was going to react. So. I got a picture of a pregnancy test and I'm driving through Amarillo and I just swerve over to the side of the road and I started screaming and shouting in a good way. I was super excited that day. It changed the the path of my life. I, I mean, like it literally, um, my life is now driven by Jesus and my children tell me exactly what I'm going to do. So uh, that day, man, that news, it, it completely changed my life. And there's a verse I've been studying in Colossians in my own kind of personal time for a few weeks now. And Colossians chapter one, there's a verse that I absolutely love. It's verse six. And it says, the same good news that came to you, that's going out all over the world. So it's talking about the good news of Jesus Christ, that he loves you, that he cares for you, that he saved you um, of your sins. Um, this same good news that's going out all over the world. It's bearing fruit everywhere by changing lives. So the good news of Jesus is going out and it's changing lives just as it changed your life from the day that you first heard it and understood the truth about God's wonderful grace. Man, the day that I saw that picture of the pregnancy test, it changed my life completely. But also the day that I gave my life to Jesus Christ, because I've told you all this before. I'm going to have to tell you all a million times. But when I was 15, uh, before this day, I, I knew that. I loved God. It's just weird. I, I just I grew up in church, so I've always loved God. But when I was 15, man, I understood that God loved me, and when I understood that, it completely changed my life. And uh, so I gave my life to Him, and I committed from that day forward, even though I've messed up a whole lot since then, to serve Him, to tell other people about how good that God is, and and to to try to show people that that good news that changed my life about Jesus Christ, it can change theirs too. So, uh, man, if you don't find me or if you don't hear from me it's probably because Brittany uh, who doesn't actually have Facebook on any of her devices found this video um, or has heard about it since then and she's not happy with me probably so um, anyways uh, y'all have a great day and we'll see you tomorrow